In this video, we'll see how we can connect to a Windows 11 machine from a, an Ubuntu machine using remote desktop. Now, the same method can be used to connect to a Windows 10 machine as well. The tool we'll be using is um, called uh, Remina, and it's not installed by default on Ubuntu, so we'll need to install it. I will uh, open the terminal to begin the installation. Uh, but before I do the installation, let's just search for the tool. And we can see it's not there under the available applications. So let's go ahead and run the commands to install it. We'll start with the apt update. So update the repositories. So let's do sudo up update. Put in the password. And this we can upgrade the packages, but we'll not do that for now. We'll go ahead and uh, run the command to do the installation. So it's going to be a kind of a long command. I'll copy and paste the command. So that's the full command. And what we're doing is we're installing the application uh, called Remina. And then uh, uh, we are installing a plugin for RDP. Uh, then we have uh, another plugin for Secret that allows us to store or to save passwords. And then there's uh, another plugin called Spice, which is a protocol for virtualized environments. And uh, RDP, of course, is a, a protocol for remote desktop connections. So we'll click, we'll press Enter here. to install the application and the three plugins. Okay, we got an error message here saying the application passwords and keys has closed unexpectedly. Uh, we don't, we're not gonna send it. Let's uh, search for the application again, I see. And now we have the application. We can also launch this Remina application from the terminal. But let's just open it. Let's close this. We'll minimize this. So this is the application we need to use to remotely connect to a Windows device. Uh, before we actually start the connection, let's go to the Windows device and make sure that remote desktop is enabled and also get the IP address. So we'll go to, this is the Windows 11 machine. It's also a virtual machine. We'll begin by uh, going to the settings here. Open the settings up. Then we'll look for remote desktop so remote desktop settings and as you can see a remote desktop is turned off we need to turn this on confirm so here we have remote desktop users you can select who can remotely access this uh, PC you can click on that and then you can add uh, the username or the user. If you don't have a user or if you wanted to add a user, just click on users. Go to add and edit. And then go to add an uh, account. And then you can click I don't have the person sign in information. That's if you don't have a Microsoft account, 
you can say add a user without a Microsoft account. And then here you can just put in the username and then the password. So that's it for that. Next thing we'll do is open the command prompt. And here we'll need to find in the IP address. So IP config. So the IP address is 172.16.1.100. This is what we'll use to connect remotely to this device. So we'll go back to the um, Ubuntu machine. And let's open a terminal. And make sure we can ping that remote device. So let's ping 172.16.1.100. And we're able to ping it. Control C. Now click on this to uh, create a new connection. You can give it the connection a name here. Just. And then the protocol is going to be RDP. The server is going to be the IP of the Windows. 11 machine which is 172.16.1.100 I'm using uh, Inotech that's the username and then here you have to put in your password okay you can you can save this then double click it and here it's saying that Another user is already signed in because I'm already signed in to that device. So the other user is going to be uh, logged off once we make a connection from the Ubuntu machine. So it's uh, spinning, it's, it's like it's uh, attempting to connect. And now we are connected to the Windows 11 machine, as you can see. I'm going to turn this off. Accept. And it's, I'm logged in as Inotech, as you can see. And this is the Windows 11 machine right here. This is the search window. You can open the command prompt. IP config, and that's the address right there. So that's it for this video. That's how you can remotely connect to your Windows 11 machine from Ubuntu using the Remina application. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.